In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Phantom Wallet to gmgn.ai. So the first thing you'll need is, of course, a gmgn.ai account. And if you don't have one yet, there's a link down below in the description, as well as in the pinned comment. You can check that out. And if you sign up using my link, you will get a 30% discount on all trading fees forever. So make sure you check that out. Now, from here, what you actually have to do to connect your Phantom Wallet to GMGN, you will first have to get a Phantom Wallet. So, in case you don't have it yet, just go to phantom.com, and over here, you can download it for Chrome. It is essentially a Chrome extension. So, click over here on their website, and then click Add to Chrome over here. As you can see, I have it inside Chrome already over here, so I don't have to do it yet again because I already have it inside Chrome. Now, this will install your Chrome extension. You will just have to confirm it. So click Add to Chrome over here and then Add again. And after this, you will see this extension up here. You can click on it and you'll be able to create your wallet and create an account. It will guide you all the way through it. It takes a few seconds. It's very simple to do. So once you have this, what you then want to do is go to gmgn.ai website and over here, you want to click Sign in with wallet. So it says or sign in with wallet. So just click on that. And then, as you can see, you can click Phantom, which is already says installed because I have it installed. And you want to just click installed over here where it says next to Phantom and it will open up this pop up window. Now, over here, you have to simply press connect. And after you do this, as you can see, your sign in has been confirmed. You can then press confirm. And just like this, you've successfully signed into GMGN using your Phantom Wallet. And you can then also switch to Telegram login. You can just click Switch TG login and then connect over here. And then you can start the bot on either your computer or you can open it in web and you can connect the Telegram that way. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.